you how to create a um, ChatGPT based careers coach uh, through quite a simple prompt, which I'm going to share uh, on screen in a moment. Uh, what this prompt does, it uh, gets ChatGPT to act in the role of a careers uh, coach. Uh, and within that, it then takes on the role as, of a um, mock interviewer. Um, all we're going to do is upload this prompt with a PDF or a Word document, which is the any any given job description, and it'll base an interview on what it sees in that document. Um, so we're going to give that a go. I'll show you this show the uh, prompt on screen, and there's a QR code that you can scan if you want to cut and paste that from my website. Okay, so I've got the mobile version of ChatGPT running here. I've cut and paste the prompt from the last screen into the chat and I've also uploaded a PDF of a job description. It's dead easy to upload a PDF. There's a plus button on the left hand side of the screen. Click that, click the file icon and then just find the PDF or the Word document that you want to be interviewed on on there and click go. I'm now going to hit the headphone button which you'll see on the right hand side of the screen and that'll start the interview process. All right, let's get started. First question, can you tell me a bit about yourself and why you're interested in this junior game developer position at YC Game Studio? I really love playing computer games, spend all my time playing them. Even I don't even go to school sometimes because I love playing computer games. That's it. Thanks for sharing that. Can you also tell me about your educational background and any relevant experience you have in game development? I don't really go in that often. If I do, I like a bit of maths, I like a bit of science, and, and that's pretty up, pretty much it. Spend most of the time not in school playing games. Uh, done a little bit of coding on a Raspberry Pi, uh, and then, uh, yeah, that's about it. Thank you for your honesty. How do you handle working in a team environment, especially when collaborating on projects or brainstorming new ideas? Uh, yeah, I really like working with teams, especially on uh, on Fortnite. Yeah, I like shooting people, basically. Uh, that's it. Okay, understood. Can you give an example of a problem you encountered while playing or working with games and how you solved it? Uh, yeah, we were trying to break into a dungeon and uh, I managed to get the uh, teams playing online to do all the hard work so I could just stand back and wait for the dungeon door to be open. Thanks for that. Lastly, how do you stay updated with the latest trends and technologies in game development? I read a lot online. I'm on like all the gaming forums like Reddit and everything like that. I'm just really obsessed. Thank you for your responses. Now let's move on to feedback and guidance. You show a strong passion for gaming, which is a great start. However, the role requires more focus on technical skills and educational background in game development. Your interest in forums and staying updated is good, but practical experience and relevant qualifications are crucial. Areas for improvement. One, educational focus. Try to complete relevant education in computer science or game development. Regular attendance and engagement will help. Two, practical experience. Start working on small game projects, even simple ones. Use platforms like Unity or Unreal Engine to get hands-on experience. Three, teamwork and communication. Improve your ability to work in teams by collaborating on projects or joining development communities. Or problem solving skills. Highlight your ability to tackle technical challenges in a game development context, not just gameplay strategies. Chances of getting the job. Based on your current skills and experience, you may need to work on the aforementioned areas before applying for such roles. Gaining practical experience and formal education in game development will significantly improve your chances. Keep building your skills and stay passionate about game development and you'll be well on your way. So you're saying I've not got a job? 